Today we're going to be going over the installation of the C-DMM-3015. First thing you want to do is remove the two OEM fasteners from the upper tray assembly. That is with a 7mm socket and ratchet. Just drop the supplied plastic spacers into the opening, lining up with the holes in the upper tray assembly. Take the entire DMM tray and slide that onto the dash towards the windshield. Once that's snugged up towards the windshield, you can take the supplied M6 bolts and washers, drop them through the opening in the upper tray until they thread into the factory speed clips in the dash. Repeat process for both sides, making sure not to snug up one side until both sides are started. Once that is complete, you can snug up those bolts and move on to the next step. You're going to take the lower dash mounting tabs, push tight to the vent assembly, and tighten the two Phillips head screws on top of the DMM tray. You can fully tighten these screws and it should pull the dash monitor mount tray tight to the dash once they are snugged up. You're going to want to repeat that process for the other side, making sure that it's even tension on both sides and that DMM tray is snug to the dash. Once that is complete, you can lift up the DMM tray door, make sure the hinge moves up and down freely and latches securely.